Hi, I'm Michael Dean. We're at the Las Vegas uh, Film Festival here, and um, I play uh, Detective Tony Patterson in the movie Sanction to Die. And um, just had a great time doing it. The movie's about a uh, martial arts uh, fighting syndicate, underground uh, friendship, love, uh, redemption, all those things kind of into one. Little uh, underlining tones in the movie. Desi's sitting there crying and thinking I'm dead, and I'm in the other room doing cartwheels and messing around trying to make her laugh. So that was fun for me. We were doing little jokes on each other the whole time. You know, Brent's tough to work with. Uh, you know, he wants organic. He wants uh, he wants you to give your best. And if you don't, he, he's going to pull it out of you. So, um, you know, it was an honor. And uh, I, I loved working with Brent. I'd work with him again anytime. You know, we'll just see. You know, I've been getting a lot of calls from different uh, producers and stuff. And uh, we'll just see what happens from here. You know, hopefully another action movie or maybe some type of romance. We'll see. Uh, CMT reality show Southern Nights. It's the number one show on CMT. And then uh, before that, I did... Um, Sweet Home Alabama, it was on uh, CMT, it was like The Bachelorette, and it was fun, it was like a southern Jersey Shore, you know, five guys, five girls living in the same house together, going out and partying, having a good time, and it was great, I mean, you know, we got into fights, we got in yelling matches, you know, you had the, the love going on, you had hookups, it was a lot of fun, so it was definitely different from filming a movie, uh, for sure. Um, I'm really glad the film is out, I'm really glad it's here at the Las Vegas Film Festival, and I think that the next step for the movie is get it on a you know red box or netflix so everyone else can see it and really um, see the passion how much work everyone put into making this movie it's a great movie i think everyone should watch it for sure you know being in las vegas you know they say there's not a lot of good actors here in vegas you have to go to la and that's not true there's a lot of talent here there's a lot of passionate people there's a lot of people that are you know pulling money out of their pockets to to pay the way through this film a lot of dedicated a lot of heart you know everyone put everything on the line for this film and that's what I love about Vegas is since there's not a lot going on like there is in Hollywood, everyone puts their passion out there to bring the very best. Just like I did, just like Vince did, you know, everybody. So I had a great time and a good experience, and I like filming movies here in Vegas. It was more of a, you know, independent type uh, martial arts feature. Uh, there wasn't a lot of big star names. I know we were working on getting some for sure. Um, all the actors were great. I loved working with them, you know. I mean, uh, you know, working with Vince, who plays Ryan, was great, you know best friends in the film and we became really good friends in real life you know working with Kathy she was the driver I, I got along with her really well and the woman that played my wife Desi she was great I mean we all had a really good time and no, there were no issues or you know or diva stuff going on in the set at least not that from what I saw so I had a great time doing it though you know when you make a low budget film you know especially here in Las Vegas you know you're not gonna get all the great editing that you want you're not gonna get all the great special effects that you want but from what we had and the money that we had to work with, I think we have an, an amazing film. Tremendous, that anyone should watch and be proud of. Every time I watch the film, I learn something new about it, something I haven't seen before. And that's not something you see all the time in the film. You know what you're going to see. You're like, okay, I know how it's going to end. And even though you know how it's going to end, it's just different. There's little key things in the movie that you missed the first time and you see the second time.